Hello paradise. Let's go. Welcome back to your daily dose, everybody. We're getting off here at perfect day. Hey. <laughs> and um, this is very interesting because we're never having a lot of people walking this way while we're actually going because a lot of people already just enjoyed their day and we're just starting our day here. All aboard is in like two hours. We gotta get off just to enjoy, enjoy a little bit of perfect day. And then we have the mason jar tonight. By the way, the Allure is right next to us. Two of the Oasis class ships smudged together. We're joined with the lovely Casey, obviously. Hello. Cowgirl Casey, I think we should say. Yes, I know I'm not wearing this hat correctly, but I saw a couple of people do it like this, and I thought it was pretty genius. So I'm, I'm Cowgirl Casey today. Everyone's wearing it like that. Hey. <laughs> you too. Look at those two big butts. Gotta love it. I love cruising, y'all. Thanks for being here every day. Look how many people are coming back on board. They already had their day. We just filmed a tour though, you guys saw that yesterday, it was fun. Let's hope it doesn't rain. Looks like it might be storming here. I don't know, but we're just getting some food and gonna hop back on. Today's gonna be all about eating. Look at that money shot. Oh yeah, three perfect models. Another reason why I wanted to get off today for just a little bit is because I really, really wanted to see Perfect Day. Last time we were here, um, it was my first time at Perfect Day, but we did only the adult section because we were able to be at a cabana. This the new time, section. This time, yeah, so this time I'll get to see the, I guess at this point, older section, but it's still new to me. That's really cool, look at this. Oh my gosh, welcome Utopia of the Seas. I that's love that. Us. Oh, that's so cute. Hopefully it doesn't rain. I will say the best part about this island is you just hop off of the ship and you're ready in it. I mean, we were just at Disney's private island and Obviously we had a 30 minute journey to get to the other side, which was beautiful, but this is just so nice because you can just get off and it's all here. Yeah. It's all like, here. I feel like if we had done what we did today, like do a whole ship tour and we were at the Disney private island, I think at this point we probably wouldn't make the journey over. We'd probably just stay on the ship. So for reference, Casey's first time, which was last time, all she got to experience was the new section at Hideaway Beach, but I'm she hasn't experienced it. all of this even though this is all separate right here. Now we're gonna do this whole area. Wait, what do you mean this whole? Oh, cause this is yeah, all this like is the water. This is the water park right here. And, and this is extra, extra, yeah. And this, okay. This is included, but that's gonna be another time. Yeah. Hold on, babe, I need some water. Really bad. Probably tropical mango, that sounds great. Oh. All right, food. Just gonna grab. You guys already know it's here. Now this is the spot. Come on now. Like, look at this. Two cities on the sea, beautiful view. No birds, gotta love it. Here's my choices. Pretty much all the main ones besides the tacos. The burgers here are unbelievable. French fries too. Surprised this many made it back. Here comes the pretty cow girl. <laughs> oh my goodness. Was this guy here the whole time? This dude is huge. Holy cow. Oh my goodness. For those who don't know, these burgers are like straight butter. It's kind of like the ones on the ship. It's unbelievable. So healthy. There's Casey's first bite. Oh my gosh. Do not enjoy this. Two of them have joined. Casey's sort of kind of freaking out. They look like dinosaurs. Oh my gosh. He's like coming at us. He's also side eyeing us the entire time. I'm getting a little freaked out. My legs are up. I don't trust anything. I think I'm ready to move. <laughs> the more you know here, there's more than one ice cream station. The other one had like 20 people in it. No one in this one. And last thing, use the tongs. If you know, you know. If you know, you know.
a perfect short day here. It's hot. It's almost already time for everybody to get back on. So we're heading back on. We have dinner coming up, a show, and who else knows? We've got quite the light up tonight. I think we have something like every hour after dinner. We'll see if we make it to everything. Be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe to Kyle Howells' channel, and get on Utopia and the Lure of the Seas. Be loyal to Royal. <laughs> best line, the best cruise line right there. <laughs>short but quick wait short but sweet that's what i'm looking for short but quick good one gal yeah i'm really happy we came in this corner yeah me too why you don't know why <gasps> we got our first duck oh, let's go we, we I, did not get shut out We'll Wait, take it. We will take it. Let's go. It took us till day two to <laughs> find a duck. Congratulations. I'm happy. Aww. We got a duck, y'all. We did it. We did it. We did it. You need to find a duck. You need to. How did you see it? Casey was so confused. I love it. How well, did you see it? I just it? looked in the corner. I'm like, let's go. Oh, like after we got in yeah, the corner. That's why okay, I said I was so okay, glad we yeah. went in this corner. Like, let's go. Well, as soon as you said, do you know why? I, I was like, okay, there's a duck. Just where is it? He's cute. And you know what? Speaking of ducks, I think this right here is to exchange ducks. You find one here with their tag. You can leave it. Oh, with their tag. You can take it and leave one. That's cool. Oh, let's go. <gasps> Did we get goodies? We got goodies. What do we got here? Does anybody know that? Is this a dog? No, I don't think so. I don't know what that is. Oh, look at that. That would have been good to have going out <laughs> there today. Been perfect. <laughs> That's a nice beach bag. What is this? This is like a. Oh, wait. There's something actually in here. Hold on. Let's find out. What is it? <gasps> what is it? Wait. That? Wait a second. What is that? Hold on. Those are steaks. Oh, this is for like, it's like a picnic thing. Picnic thing. Is it? Yeah. Oh, these... it's like for, wait, wait, wait. Like a beach. Like oh, a, it's like... for the beach. That is nice. Oh, that's cool. Wait, that's really nice. That's a new one. That's actually good marketing too. That's great. That's genius marketing. I like that they have different things than an icon because we got a gift every single night. So we have a lot of icons. We stuff. do. Wait, that's actually really cool. Yeah, that's smart marketing. We'll have to take this to the beach next time. When do we go to the beach? We will be going to the beach one day. Casey's getting ready, and I'm watching the Call of Duty Championships. Optic is about to play. My team, my other team, 100 Thieves just won, but shout out to those who, who uh, play games and watch Call of Duty. I guess one of the negatives to an interior, I don't feel the ship moving, so I don't think we've sailed away yet. Tonight's a big night for us because we're trying the mason jar and I'm really, really excited for the mason jar because I've only had it for brunch and everything looks delicious. I mean, look at this menu. Now I'm unsure how it works. Like, can we order a million appetizers? Can we order the jalapeno bread with the biscuits? I don't really know, but I'm excited to learn and I'm excited to try it because this honestly looks so flipping good for a good price too. $49 per person? Yeah, $49. Yeah, 49. I mean, chops is a little bit more expensive, but the mason jar, I'm really excited to, to give it a go and, and to see how it is, to see if it's worth it for you guys. And by the judge of it, by the food, it, it sounds great. And hopefully by the taste of it too, it's gonna be great. We got real life Bridgerton right here. <laughs> Casey looking fire. Bridgerton? Yeah. Your dress reminds you of Bridgerton. <laughs> No. Not what I was going for, but... <laughs> it was the music. There was a violinist playing Despacito, you know, and he came all the way over I'm like, ah, Bridgerton. Well, thank you. <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> it smells like food. We just walked out into the lobby area, and I think we're smelling Giovanni's, although it kind of smells like it's coming from a mason jar. Could be up there. It's two decks up. It smells smells like, great. It smells like 
buttermilk biscuits and bacon and all the good fixings. Soon. I think I, oh, I thought this was a duck. I thought that was a very tiny duck, but it's not. It's like, I just found a duck. We got to go do a cruise thing and actually look at the ocean because we haven't really done that, this ship. We're going to change it. Also, I do have a confession. We have uh, cheated oh. at the no elevator challenge. So yes. yeah. we failed at this ship. I will I will be honest about that. We failed. We have truly done the no, <laughs> the no uh, stairs, stairs challenge. challenge on this one, yeah. as Kyle always says. Come. Oh, the food smells so good. <laughs> so since we failed the... Hello there. Hey, what's up? <laughs> so, y'all, since we officially failed the challenge, we're going to take the elevators up, but not down. How about that? How about that? I like that. It's a really good. I mean, we did a whole tour of the ship today. It was, it was, you know, it's lots of stairs. So we're just like, we gotta, we gotta take the elevator once. We're gonna be doing this tomorrow, the longest one. I, I can't wait. We're gonna try to see all of the shows here tonight. Obviously, the Aqua Show. It'll be in today's vlog. Gotta love the entertainment on Royal Ships. Love it, love it, love it. Here's why we cruise. Sorry, it's taken us a while. Wow. Got a carnival ship. Got something over here too. It's golden hour. I will say the Wi-Fi on this ship has been amazing. They have Starlink and it is amazing. Wi-Fi is great. If you wanna not be unplugged, it's worth it. Especially those who do need a vlog too or whatever. It's, it's great. Remember how uh, from uh, our second video we posted on this series, how we're talking about how the ship seems more like a party type vibe? It, it's kind of because it is, but there's actually like a family party going somewhere over here. I've, I've never seen it uh, like on any other ship before. So we're gonna go check it out. This is officially called Family Res Aleutian. Let's go check it out. Got booty, Susan. Got no idea what this is. Bring the whole family and experience lightning creating inc incredible images. Okay, of all ages. It's very crowded. <laughs> yeah, I feel so bad for the DJ. Yeah. I mean, it's at a time where a lot of people are eating, so there's that. But it's like a it's a family dance party. Well, if you have early dining, like the what is it, five thirty? Yeah. Then you can definitely make this. So that's probably why they schedule it this way, because most kids that would probably want to come out and dance would have already eaten. I mean, it's a really cool dance floor. Honestly, you see this with the ice show. They're trying to get everyone to come on the dance floor right now, these kiddos. Okay, good. There's people going on the dance floor. Go, kids. Go, go, go. Go. <laughs> that is definitely for the younger ones. For sure. Well, we're going to pop on over here to go to the 715 show uh, inside the Royal Theater. We didn't get to see this on the tour of the ship, so this is the first time we're going to be headed on in here. Let's go see what this is about. All in. Welcome to uh, Utopia of the Seas Royal Theater. It's about a 50 minute show. Fortunately, we're not gonna be able to stay for all of it since we do have 745 dinner inside the mason jar. And there's actually a lot of people here. Now, the last time I was in a Royal Theater was when we saw Hairspray on a lure, and it was amazing. There's no theater productions, but holy cow, this is stunning. This is huge. Wow. Yeah, let's sit back here. We love the beeps. Uh -huh. <laughs> Listen. 
Royal shows always have the best production, best dancers. It's simply amazing. They're really good. They do have another late show. We're probably gonna come on back because it's a good production. It's so good. Okay, first impression of that show? I wanna come back. I didn't know that I wanted to see it that bad, but I wanna come back because it's that good. I think that we need to we need to time it so that we can go to the 9.30 show at the right time so we can see the rest of the show. Also, uh, shows come off way better in person than camera. You have to like, cause you feel the music, you feel everything. So obviously come to these. These are like one of my favorite parts about coming on Royal. <laughs> We're in the elevator. Aww. See, okay. we pressed the wrong floor. That's how we, you know, we never elevator. Oh my gosh. We're on a roll. Duck number two. Time for the mason jar. Live music. They got live music at the bar here. It's quite the hangout. Apparently, uh, the Mason Jar Bar is a huge hangout spot. I didn't know that. But we're gonna be in the restaurant over here. Oh! I don't know if you guys can't tell, but we have we have live music. They pump it actually into the atmosphere here too, so it's a really fun experience. But the Mason Jar, you guys saw it. I believe it's all you can eat if you want. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. But the people next to us, we we're kind of chatting with them. And they ordered some stuff to go too, so. Mom's cooking some stuff in the kitchen, the mason jar. First time here, I can't wait. See you guys. I love how cute it is in here. Like it just feels like we're, we're doing some country cooking. We're gonna get all the good food, all the fixings. I'm hungry. I actually came here this morning. Here's a, a whole video of the place empty. I mean, there's people here now, so it was nice to come here and kind of get a whole look at it when there was nobody here. Oh, Casey and I are in such a good mood. Like, we're just so excited to be here. I think we're gonna get something to drink here. They're all 14 bucks. I think I'm gonna get the PB&J old fashioned because why the heck not? By the way, it comes with the fresh from the oven, buttermilks and biscuit and the jalapeno cornbread. <laughs> I love the vibe in here. It's really fun. It's the energy is like just very welcoming, welcoming. It's like Southern stuff. I love it. I feel like we are home. If you have a, in case you said it, I feel like we're home. It's loud, but it's a nice date night, right? Two thumbs up. Hi, Casey. What did you decide to order right now? Because we just did a Uno, Uno re reverse card. Um, it's kind of a lot, and I'm a little nervous because I know it's going to be a lot of food, but we're going to get the beef brisket, the national hot chicken. You can get that regular or national hot. Obviously, going to make it hot. And then I think we're going to try the Cajun fries and the mac and cheese and maybe coleslaw too. <laughs> That's what I was going to do, but we can't do two of the same. So I'm going to get the crispy chicken sandwich, which also looked good too. And then we're going to do pimento cheese as well as the blueberry Johnny cakes and the smoked devil eggs, baby. We're ready to eat. I'm ready to eat. Let's go. Let's go.
I love that. I, I love this. I'm actually feeding off of it right now. Now, if you don't like a rowdy dinner, this might not be for you. I'm pretty sure they do live music in here like every night. So it's a, it's a fun time, but it's definitely not for everybody. It's for me. And for me. You're right to say you can say that girl was good as gone. My goodness, thank you. You are you rock. So we got my drink here. I got the peanut butter and jelly. Ah, oh, smells great. We also have some peanut butter and jelly with it here. But he said because the drinks were waiting long. He got me one on the house. This is what Casey got. This is a moonshine. I suppose this is like the best drink here. But I had to get mine, so cheers. Cheers. I had to get, you know, you know, my usual. Oh my is it good? <laughs> Oh, I'm so happy we got two of these. <laughs> this is so good. Well, cheers to two drinks. You gotta love that. This is an absolute chugger. It's very sour, but wow. Wow, I like how they put fresh fruit in there in the bottom. I'm getting a lot of like the, the blackberries all broken up. <laughs> all I can say is, let's have this drink in but cheers. I gotta say, this one, it's got a hint of peanut butter and jelly in it, but it's, it goes down so smooth. So smooth. All right, our smoked deviled eggs have arrived. I can tell, like, the, like, the enhancement that we're actually, you know, paying for the food. It's not the included food. Fried chicken skins dusted with paprika. There's peppers, crispy capers. And then we've got the jalapeno cornbread with whipped honey butter and Cajun butter as well. This Cajun butter is unbelievable, and these biscuits are so good too. We're probably gonna run out of this. We're gonna need some more. The jalapeno cornbread is some of the best cornbread I've ever had in my life. It's so flavorful, has a really nice kick, and I love it paired with the Cajun butter. Really flavorful. The pimento cheese has arrived. I'm gonna probably eat all this because Casey doesn't like pimento cheese, but we're getting the food in. It is coming quick right now. Blueberry Johnny Cakes. Savory cornmeal flapjacks slathered with barbecue pulled pork, crispy chicken skin, and coleslaw. And there's a blueberry pancake on the bottom. All I gotta say right now is I'm like in a food coma. This has just been an amazing dinner. Amazing dinner. But I can see how it's not gonna be for everyone because of the music, but the food is unbelievable. The dessert list. We only have room for one. We're gonna split it. Twice fried Oreos. Gotta, gotta see what that's all about. They also have Georgia peach ice cream. They also have some uh, grown-up shakes, which look delicious, and then some kid ones for the youngins. Our Oreos have arrived. Well, if it's just like tonight is gone, this is gonna be absolutely delicious. So far, that is the highlight of our cruise. That was a lot of fun. There's a lot of rowdy people in that bar, so that is why that is not for everybody. And I'm telling you, that is some of the best food on the ship. Mason Jar, we love you, and I cannot wait to go back. It's just as good as brunch. It's so good. I have never been more full in my entire life. Oh my gosh, we forgot our, our plate of food. Oh, shoot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh well. It was so good. We love it. Oh. Definitely try it out, but you, you gotta know it's gonna be loud in there. It's, got, it's gonna be loud, but it's gonna be some of the best food you've had. Oh my God. On to the show again. Also, Casey really hurt her knee somehow walking up the stairs, so we have to take the elevator now. Oh, darn. <laughs> no, but for real? She really did. I My knee keeps like almost giving out on me. Maybe it's just my sign that I'm really out of shape and I need to start yeah. doing some knee exercises. We actually just picked up the show exactly where we left it at.
The visuals with this show are just very stunning. It's beautiful. It's so well done. I've never seen drones in this show before. That's so cool. No way. On to the Aqua show. Had to leave during the last act because uh, we might not get a seat at the Aqua show. It starts in like 10 minutes. This is gonna be a good test to see how late you can show up and see if you can get a spot. It's 10 minutes of show time, so cross your fingers. <laughs> Oh, it's raining out. It's back to the future. Star Wars? <laughs> We are currently experiencing unforeseen difficulties, but expect our performance to resume shortly. Resume our performance soon. Let's go. I thought it was going to be too windy for them, but they're going to do it. They're going to balance. You ever seen this? No. Is this your first time seeing this? I think so. Oh, wow. That is terrifying. I know they're... It's, they're it's scary. Never gets old. I have some very good takeaways from today that were my highlights. Number one, the drones at the show. So cool. That was cool to see. And then the mason jar, which <laughs> some of you guys aren't going to like it. It's it's on the Wonder. I don't know if it's on any other cruise ship, but I love it. I love it. I love today. We made two vlogs today on my grandpa's birthday. Um, so that was this is a special day. 
But um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It might be a little bit longer. I don't know. I kept a lot of the entertainment in. Um, you have to see it in person. It's so much better in person. He is right in that um, the mason jar was my favorite experience we've had on this ship so far. The food was amazing. Our server, Barry, was amazing. And it was just such a fun vibe with the music. I also love country music, so I was jamming to like almost every song. I really had a great time. It was an overall amazing day. It was really good. We're going to go off camera right now, so we'll see you guys tomorrow. I think one more. One more cruise vlog. We'll be tomorrow. Wow. Bye-bye. NASA tomorrow.